you ask any fan of the Champions League what their favourite show on TV is and there seemingly is only one correct answer. Even if it doesn't beam to your TV screens in the UK, this particular show, CBS's excellent coverage of UEFA's preeminent club championship, has captured the imagination of fans up and down the country and beyond, in no small part due to their all-star, stellar and now iconic lineup led by the wonderful Kate Abdo, the legendary Thierry Henry, and of course the man who kicked off the Blue Moon dynasty by winning a Premier League title <laughs> with Manchester City back in 2012. You okay there, Micah? What a start that was. How one. you doing? What, what an intro that was. You were absolutely fantastic at your job. You know what? You can replace Kate for a couple of times. I Never. I didn't realise it was going to be so tough. <laughs> And finally, Robin, your favourite jersey, number 10 at Arsenal or number 20 at Man United? I have to make a decision. I hope so, Robin. Yeah, yeah I, I would go for 20 because uh, that story is, has more impact. Robin, Rob, what's up, man? Thank cheers. You. Thank you so much. Sorry about the really? Oh, oh, my days. This is the, the most difficult. Who's got the brightest future, Martial or Rashford? Oh. Tough um. on that. <laughs> Rashford. Major League Baseball are now back in London after a four-year absence and Commissioner Rob Manfred recently said that the number of fans who identify as consumers of baseball here in the UK has doubled since the last time they were here. What they're doing is they're targeting a passionate, knowledgeable and most importantly a young fan base. The, the best owners in football, when they came in they've made a lot of promises and they've kept them. And they're amazing, they really are. They mean the world's was. It's so cool, man. And we appreciate everybody over there in the UK for, for tuning in and uh, at, the, at those awkward hours. Always ask me, what was your favorite touchdown celebration? And I always say, the margin of the guards when I was in London. Great friends with Harry Kane. Congratulations, Harry Kane. Tottenham Hotspurs, baby. potential implications of a World Cup every two years on the sporting schedule and on the wider sporting landscape. Thank you. Uh, this uh, would have a, a very serious effect on uh, the overall sports calendar uh, for, for all sports. Sid Coley was watching. Sid Coley reports. Sid Coley reports. Sid Coley reports. Here's Sid Coley. Giroud, though, was determined to have his name up in lights. Left foot, right foot, header. Perfect hat-trick from the Frenchman, but a final flourish was still to come. Chelsea's newest star, Callum Hudson-Odoi, buried his chance to score their fifth. A stumble in Kiev, no chance, as Chelsea cruised to the quarter-finals in some style. Sid Coley, BBC News. You knew all the moments. I like that. Yeah, I like yeah, that. I love those moments.